hii kapungala ilikuwa na anything to do with kapuka ama, yeah. yeah kapungala ilikuwa you know hii ngoma ilikuwa ilikuwa ngoma interesting sana yeah, yeah. because nilikuwa na idea vile nimekwambia growing up nilikuwa napenda ningala sana yeah. so nilikuwa shida ilikuwa at that time ngoma zilikuwa zina do poa zilikuwa ngoma za kapuka yeah. So wewe kuja kizazi watu lingala na watu wanataka kapuka. Yeah, yeah. So what I did ni combine my love for lingala mm. and what was training at that time. Kapuka. So kapungala ni short for kapu ya kapuka na ngala ya lingala. Yeah, that's yeah. that's when kuja jina kapungala. So even the track itself nilikwenda kai sound. Kapuka ikianza na lingala ikiisha. Yeah, yeah. So getting a producer who can merge the two ilikuwa hard sana. Yeah. So my producer kama watatu wakihepa. Yeah. Oh, oh okay. Because ni hard because unajua hii ngoma tempo ya side ya kwanza ni kama 96. Mm. Alafu tempo ya lingala inakuja kama 110. Mm, mm. So unajua ni kama track mbili unakuja unazichikanisha yeah, ndio zinaki yeah, yeah, sense. Kwa sababu kwa unajua kufanya tra- unajua transitioning ya lingala kwa very different na, mm, na hizi zetu. Mm, mm. So nikapata jamani toa Dr. Edi huko Eldoret. Mm. Nilikuwa nimeenda tu mara round zangu. Yeah. Mm. Sasa kana studio hapa, nikaingia studio. Mm. Nikapata jamaa na jua hapa hey, unafanya nini huko bro? Alikuwa anatoa edu at that time. Mm. Edu mm. unafanya nini hapa kanaambia? Pia amekuja tu LD ku ku unwind. Eh yeah, yeah. studio mm. na tukatengeneza hiyo track. Hiyo track tukimetengeneza na msemu mwingine alikuwa anatoa BZB before that. Yeah. So BZB ni kama ilimlemea so nika, nikapelekea Dr. Edi. So mm. aka akatengeneza na kaya understand chini nilikuwa nataka kufanya mm. na tukamekea sasa hiyo kapungala. Oh, okay. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so it in any influence ya lingala ndio ile kuzata hiyo papa fololo yeah, ni ni lingala sana ilikuja hiyo jina papa fololo mm. interesting mm. at that time longomba za kwa beshe zangu sana eh, eh. so longomba nikuja nilikuwa nashindanga kwao naenda kwao sana vitu kama hizo eh. so nikienda kwao madhake madha yao so unjua alikuwa unjua vyao ni kama community na vitu kama hizo mm. so nilikuwa ngamse napenda joke sana na vitu kama hizo mm. So one day nikakuja na flower nikapatia madhake. Oh, okay. Mm. So kwa ki French flair ni flower. Mm. So papa follow na manisha a gentleman who di- dishing out flowers. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 But sasa hiyo ni jina inajulikana mostly in Congo and all that. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Na nini? Uh, talking of the logombas mm. like ulikuwa ina maisha ulikuwa tight now eh? Very tight. Sasa so, so, mm. hata wana kan create more influence ya kwanza kujua hizo words kama papa for lolo onkele mm. mtu lele hizo vitu zote hizo mm. mawazimu sema kwa ngoma. Mm. So kushina nao pamoja. Kwa hiyo pia walikuwa wanaongea Kiswahili ya Kikongole. Yeah, yeah. eh, mm. Most of the time it's more of Congolese than Kiswahili. Mm. So kukana nao sana ndio kan create your influence. Yeah. Yeah. Yo mtu lele ina maisha? Mtu lele ni mtu wa maana. Oh, mtu eh, wa maana. Uncle ni uncle, uncle mm. wa maana. So mtu lele ni mtu wa maana. Mm. Yeah. Asa vile nani waliwenda kama juu? Yo yeah. contact kaisha. Ah bado mwanga na lovi. Mm. Eh hata Christie before pass bado tulikuwa tunamba bonga bonga. Kiasi lakini kwa naongea na lovi sana. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so lovi bado niongea. Eh lovi si ongea bado. Oh okay. Yeah, lovi si ongea bado. Oh okay. Yeah, hata yeah. only making kama tracks tulikuwa tunafanya vitu pamoja yeah, most of the time. Mm. So hapo mm. ndo pale influence yangu so most of the time ile tokea. Yeah yeah. yeah. Cuz uh lovi sasa hizi ni prophet. Eh? Yeah, yeah. Nyinyi ma base so siwezi so taka get into whatever with that. Eh? Yeah. But still I'd have to ask you then cuz I have to look at the whole gospel industry as yeah. this yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's about spreading the word yeah. so mse kama bambu umekuwa kichukuaje hizi stories zake cuz bambu amekuwa places more back sema i think ali mezona nyoka alipatiwa the devil gave him a deal mm. uh, the deal was supposed to be in millions mm. um wewe mwenyewe ushabonga hapa uli make millions lakini sije hiki ukisema umemezwa na nyoka so ulichukua hii deal ya the devil ama ni interesting yeah because uh, this is what i always say yeah music music is a very powerful tool yeah music ni eh, music ni powerful kuliko kuliko wasio kwa mebeba wasio kwa mebeba wajuangi the power of music mm. wasani wengi wajuangi the power of what they are carrying wasani wengi sana but sasa inakuwa na levels that you are kuna level zenye lazima ufike unaanza kuingia in a different zone mimi mm. nakumka 2010 after winning the mamas eh mm. mm. nilifika mahali nikafeel nikaa nimefika pinacle eh? nikaanza kujiuliza what's more mm. how can i challenge this what i've already done yeah umenelewa so at that sp- in that space ndo wasi wengi so wamo ku take a different turn mm. because now umeacha the fame and the, all these things that's na kujana music 
zianze ku control who you are music music is spiritual even when i'm saying yeah music is very spiritual any song that you listen to is very spiritual mm. Mm. what matters is who or where the musician and a tap into mm. Mm. akuna music is spiritual yeah. whether you like it or not mm. akuna so kuna sasa zile extremes na ndanga kuingia mm. na hizo vitu mimi nime nimesikia nimekana sikia artist na sikia vitu wanafanya unasikia msiadi oh msiadi na kala kwa kaburi hizo vitu but they so happen yeah. okay because at the end of the day mziki lazima ipushiwe cuz haiezi pushiwa natural cuz siki to physical that you see a song from the scene is song eh is song nikisikia inakupatia ngati feeling flani mm. you can't define it you can't describe it but iko na your feeling flani so you extreme bambo ashai fika mm. miss day fika because ndio sababu mwana ongea about ya shai kwa secular yeah yeah nda kuja gospel mm. so is a extreme miss day fika because ye you see in secular it means so what come sit na believing now on our part you yeah. have to pray more you have to fast more you have to mm. enter into more of the spiritual realm mm. but sasa in the secular world it means there's something more they do mm. mm. kwa biblical there's a prophet alisema bring me the musicians who are singing wakisha imba al prophesy ina maanisha music ina inakufungua inakufungua anga tu another realm of spirit yeah yeah oh okay so whatever he's saying i've not gone to that extreme Mm, mm. I, I I've never been there mm. but by the way he was in secular music mm. he understand what he's saying. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Yeah, so vile uh, umesema pray more fast more unataka sema hakuna gospel musicians on ono. Kwa nini? Kuliko na wanono crew. So you see fasting, it mean that okay, hiyo nika kusema hakuna Muslims wanaona. See how fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah fasting they mean that una fast for the rest of your life. Mm, mm. Yeah, a span of duration flan. Mm. Yeah. Na hii transition ya nini? Haikuwa like mse hi conversation we have na love you when he said like he was a prophet and sikit lazima bonge juu yake contact mm. bonga juu yake cuz nakumbuka kwa time nishai joke juu yake hapa iko nini kisema mm. eh hey, mimi mm. Z. Mina jua the logombas as the logombas. Hakuna mm. mtu anza take that away from me aniambia jua prophet. Mm. Just, uh, mm. So your conversation ili happen ama ilikuwa tu ah. No me ni yana tu. Mi mm. uh, the transition siku siku ona the transition iki happen passe. Yeah. But nilijana mostly after shanza ku blow up. Yeah, so yeah. I think most of the time tulikuwa tunaongea sana 2020 hiyo time ya covid tulikuwa tunaongea oh, sana okay. sana sana yeah, sana hiyo yeah, time yeah, covid yeah. after covid ni nini mm. akakuja Kenya kiasi hivi kwa hizo tumekuwa tunaongea anga hizo on and off on yeah, and off eh okay understand yeah. okay, so na mother pia madao hapana au madao iko hapa au madao die au madao die yeah, madao die oh, okay yeah, okay pole 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 kwa eh because walienda huko kwa refugees ama eh eh cuz nile Sio kuna kwa ngeo period ya kungoja refugee status kwe. Si ni report wote sana. No lo hii ushai perform huko state bado. Oh. Yeah. Hey, even at the imagine siko hai. What? Wasa huko wapindi. Noma ilikuwa. Mm. You didn't have one of those regrets. Yeah. Because at that time most of the time nilikuwa na itwe states naambiwa utakuja church. Mm watu wa sadaka uh, tukupatie okay na hapa mm. safa na kupiga so mbili mm. ama so yeah na hiyo time kwenda seti iko kama saa hii kuna zile ukianda mtu anakwambia la muende kama 3 months 4 months hakuna uh, uh, hiyo tu mwingine umetoka hakuwa mm. hizo privilege na wasanii wa sanii wako nazo hizo uh. ilikuwa lazima ukienda umeenda tua mm. na hizo tua lazima utakaa kama 2 months mm. so unapiga hesabu unaonaje at the pinnacle of my career mm apa corporate nilipa fiti mm. kule ni handouts ni handouts mm. utaenda mm. kule kuna kupatia vibes za matri 
Wasoa chote wako. Wasoa chote wako. Umenisika eh? Na unajua some hapa Kenya sayo me fight for a very long time for gospel artists utokeo face ya. Cuz unajua gospel artists at that time ilikuwa ngatumo of utaenda church perform watu sadaka wa ku bless hapo mbele. Kwa za kuungana negotiation unajua msanii huko unaweza na church tunataka pesa fulani. Ilikuwa ngosha imba sadaka sadaka leta ndio nachukua ndio unachukua sasa una perform si the main church mm. si una perform wala sasa kuja na kitu kwa chapo mbele ndio ya hiyo ndio mblesiwa so yeah. mentality yako ni hiyo unapiga hesabu unashindwa ai ini kitu nime fight for all these years tufike hii level ya, ya, ya corporate mm. sasa ni ndio hiyo aspect so siku ya na set because of that because most of the events ni going to set zilikuwa hizo za oh umeelewa mm. hakuna any clear clear cut deal mm. ni kam utaishi kwangu Mm. and then we can moja unaenda kuishikwa nani mm. you can you know tenda dollars mm. you can you know tenda sijikwa nani sasa unapiga hesabu unashindwa ah bro mm. na hapa saa hiyo uko na event Mombasa uko na event Kampala uko na event mm. Busia uko mm. na una get eh mm. Mm. na yote ni do mm. na yote ni do apart from do hii ni kitu ume, ume long for yeah yeah una perform kwa 10000 crowd KC pale inje pale imejaa sasa hiyo safari kwa inafanya show big mm. ukaka saa world cup cock inafanya world cup mafans mm. wamejaa unapiga show unajua hizo yeah. yeah. event unapiga bro mm. so msia kuitia wasa uko majua na kupiga picha na kuanza zile event unapiga za machachu huko mm. mm. chachi kwa na 15 50 unapiga sababu oh. unaona ah bro mm. mm. sasa hii na hakuna ndo nakupatia deal ya kami weekend piga mm. show and then urudi yeah, wasa yeah. anakuambia zile za three months mm. two months and then pia rafalo kama endaenda na rafalo kwa ndangizo ma two months da rudi mm. ah unaona hapana oh, okay mm. na nini nilikufundisha nini uh, money discipline cuz nikiona nini yako uh, nikiona ukibonga nikao wewe uh, ndikuwa gamse alikuwa unajua ulikuwa disciplined mm. you come to do mm. nilikufundisha financial discipline mm. considering how to grow up in in quotes a rich family my bro mm. my bro rafa alikuwa na discipline fit sana mm. eh so alikuwa anifundisha na niambia kuna mtu mwingine za kam say once once za kuja na 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 na, na asa ishi hapo yeah. and then pia kuna phone call moja sasa sawa klemo alinipigia ngathe say ni pick tv kapungale mepick hivi mm. klemo akani call yeah. akanambia oen jua ni period mm. jua ni window yeah. it last forever mm. utilize kama mahali setting ngoma yako si kali mm. lakini sauti yako imechokesha tu masikio ah ah si mnoma mm. but they're just yearning for something different mm. so nilikuwa na hiyo kitu at the back of my mind mm. na unjua sasa kile mahali kampiga ile deal ya orange yeah yeah mm. ile jua lako kwa 5 million eh mm. 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 so nilikuwa na maona na hiyo point ya he knows what he's doing yeah Yeah. So watu kama hao walikuwa wanipata hiyo aspect ya kuanda sand hey, by the way nafaka kufanya hivi nafaka kufanya hivi nafaka kufanya hivi hivyo. Mm. So vile yeye yeah, get your deal mm. alienda paki akijenga. Yeah. Wewe deal zako uli like the first big check uliyopata ilikuwa pesa ngapi ama ilikuwa hizo so tatu so tatu. Me the biggest uh, check ya kwanza I think ilikuwa kujengea mother. Hiyo nilikuwa. Yeah. Oh okay. Uh, kujengea yeah. mzae na, na mother keja. Hiyo mm. nikitumia kwanza musema. Because hiyo ilikuwa deal yangu ya kwanza ya Airtel. Mm. Mm. Oh Airtel walikuwa yeah. mangapi? Uh, I think pakea kwanza ilikuwa 4.7 and then ah. I think total mm. to, total ya hiyo the whole deal mm. I think ilikuwa kama 7 meter. Yeah. Mm. Wow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Na hii sasa ni way before easy deals za road shows za Safaricom. Am I near after road shows za Safaricom? Ilikuwa in the middle because your time ilikuwa kama 20 2010 up. Yeah, I woke yeah. you like the fact you working with Safari Com, you can't work with us. Sasa you know, me no kwa the one of the most weird deals in the country. Yeah. Nikiwa Airtel, contract yangu imeisha. Mm. Safari Com anakuja kanibuy out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Bro, mimi na mwangu hizo leo amini. Mimi za mpaka mtu Safari Com anakuja kupiga hizo ndio watu understand. Mm. Walikuja wakanibuy out. Walikuja yeah. wakaniambia, "Imbaki how long?" Mm. Nikamwambia kaniambia, "We want you. Mm. We want to sign you." Il kwa mpaka how long? I got three months. Three, three months. months. More than three months. So three months ilikuwa worth like how much? Eh uh, I think per month nilikuwa napigwa how much? Can't even remember. I think per month nilikuwa napigwa kama so 8 ama so 9. I can't remember. 
Mm. So safcom tuseme safcom ali patia na mita 3 akasema free him. Eh hey, mimi bro yangu ni eh hey, yangu ilikuwa noma because mm. nilitoka hapo nikaingiza tena safari kom nimetoka mm. airtel hivi. Mm. Sikuwa na break. Mm. Kwa nje pia endorsement watu wajaye watu wajaye ambia. Yeah, yeah. When you sign an endorsement lazima uko na grace period before you sign another endorsement. Mm. Mm kwanza kama ni competing brands kama si competing brands ni okay but kama ni com- because wasa wanakuambia nga when we use your image yeah, yeah. tumezeka kwa billboards tumezeka kwa card zetu za airtel mm. vitu kama hizo ama tumechukua image zako tumezeka paka digital yeah? Yeah. before to zitoa it take time mm. na aise clash na image yako kwa yeah. another competing yeah, yeah. so hata contract inaweza kuimisha kama this year contract inaweza kama this year june but kuna grace period lamo patio kampuni mm-hmm. kama six months ya kutoa vitu zako ya kutoa vitu zao mm-hmm. so in those six months ina maanisha uweze kuzana another competing company mm-hmm. but bro mimi nilichukuliwa ni, ni bro yeah, yeah. yeah, nilichukuliwa before grace period na before even the contract ends yeah. na nikasaini na, na safari kwa na hii deal ya airtel kai ilikuwa 7 like total 7 ingine ilikuwa total kama ngapi eh hey, ilikuwa pia pia ilikuwa big mm. ya yeah, ilikuwa big cuz nakumbuka ilikuwa mo. Mm. Eh, I think ilikuwa mo. Mm. I can't remember exactly mm. but najua ilikuwa mo. Yeah. 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 Yeah kwa nenda na angalia records now the real owen si wacha daddy owen oh ni mwati eh onega mko ki file ka zero ndio eh ama mko ki nini so eh wewe mwenyewe kusasa deal ya kwanza usha jengea mother at what point do wewe mwenyewe ulijijengea ulifanya yeah me of course ka jengea ocha nikafanya nikafanya projects kadhaa kuna projects unafanya zinadunda zingine unafanya zinaenda poa nikafanya of course projects mob Mm. but uh, eventually zingine nikachukulia loan zingine nikaelewa yeah, yeah. mm. so kuna hiyo face yenye ili affect sana kwa life yangu mm. yeah but kuna hiyo face yenye nili learn more yeah yeah, yeah ah. ilikuwa affect unamaanisha eh kuna face nili nili kulikuwa na laxity in my in my career yeah, like yeah. i feel like kama nimefika pale nimefaa kufika mm. and all that mm. and then nika 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 derail from focusing on what was bringing in the money yeah yeah nikaanza ku focus on other things mm. and uh, of course unajua sasa sasa hiyo hakuna chapa inaingia mm, mm. sasa unajua na kule ile umeweka yeah, yeah. yeah, sasa hiyo ndio ilikuwa one of those faces mm because you need the bit to have gina na na wase hapa mu encourage you wase sana kita kujenga fast jenga oja mm. kwa sababu bega tu vile technology na change mm. tukio the same thing kwa tunabonga in the first hour tukibonga juu ya vile watu dharau kitu kianza ah kitu hizi fika pale ya cuz internet kiwa oja mm. what's the difference between nairobi na oja mm. tukiwa na fast speed internet mimi usema by the ukitravel uko nyinyi u understand what the evolution is yeah. uta understand why unafa ku appreciate kama uko male kama uko kakamega yeah. na una make chapa yako vizuri kama hivi kama wewe unjoe sana unaweza move na hii yeah, na wish yeah. anyway yeah yeah unaanza sana mm. sema tu no, no man hiyo kuni get za kuniita yeah yeah itakuwa hard eh, ndio yeah. yeah. lakini imagine ujenge industry ya male kasi haya yeah ujenge kwa big ufanye tu akina usito kale mm, mm. my interview mm. unaje ba unapiga tu nini zako unatasonga yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. so ina make sense sana wase waanze ku embrace kwa sababu sasa naanza kufanya farming in Nairobi naanza ku invest in Nairobi na jenga vitu in Nairobi hivyo mm. yeah yeah cuz tunafaa ku respect uh, in Nairobi yani yeah, unaona gani kaki ya si tunai tunai dharau dharau eh yeah, yeah. um alafu nini ilikuwa around ilikuwa during covid mm. ndio ilianza ku make headlines juu ya now divorce yako eh mm. so nataka tu rewind kidogo ulimit ulimitaje wife ulimitaje udemso ulikam kumari mm. my ex limit uh, your time yo i think come on around 2012 hap oh mm. uliona yeah. for that long yeah so 2012 mkakam kumarika which uh, year around 2016 2016 uh. 
Oh, okay. Um so mlikuwa married for long? Ka 5 years. 5 years. Okay, okay. Internet was interesting sana. Cuz internet ilifanyika kan kama marriage yenyewe iku last that long. Wewe ni kwamba kitu moja eh. Mm. eh one thing I noticed na hii na hii story yangu ni internet iliongea uongo mob. Yeah, so yeah. the mobs ilisema you see the, the, the defense ilikuwa singeza na nitoke huko nyingine naweza ku, ku, ku clear yeah. the air na kusema hii ndio story ya ukweli, hii si ukweli, hii ni uongo. Because the worst thing at that time what I realized is eh, the internet was really pushing me eh. Mm. Ama bloggers wasi wa interviewers wa media wasi walikuwa ni push sana even the fans wasi walikuwa yeah, yeah. wasi walikuwa ni push sana ni ni tanish jina ya my ex man yeah wasi walikuwa ni push sana yani ile sema yeye ni mbaya sema yeye but for me one thing bro yani whether you like it or not mm. uni madam watu wangu man yeah yeah hata nini ifanyike mm. si, si change hiyo mm, mm. na unakumbuka ukumbuke hao watu hii hizi vitu tunafanya kwa internet saa hii hao mm. watu hiyo watazi watch yeah, yeah. na hakuna mtu anaweza kaa chini ya onange budaka alienda kwa interview kwa ngiambaje ya madha kwa ngiambaje ya madha mm, mm. umenishika so wasao walikuwa nani push ile yani ilifika mahali wasao create a very negative vibe mm. ndio history kai so negative ndio nikuje niongee so ifanye everything iko correct yeah. according to the narrative mm, mm. yeah so mimi nilikuwa niyo point ya i don't think it's necessary mm. no matter what happened yeah mm. siezi na mahali naanza kutanisha jina nda benefit nini yeah 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 mimi siezi siezi yo 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 si si mimi mm. na ni kitu siezi fanya oh. so even my best even my wasi wa media mm. wasi wengi walikuwa na hiyo oh ni mbona unaogopa kusema si useme tu mm. si uongee si useme mm. nini ilifanyika but I'm, I'm like of course zingine wana dig wanapata zingine wanapata ukweli zingine wapati ukweli but yeah, sir, yeah. at the end of the day ilikuwa ni kama wewe ndio the voice of correction ukifika pale ukiconfirm yeah. iki tu ame dig hii mm. narrative yao inamaanisha then it's true mm. so mimi nikafika tu mahali nikaanza kusema I don't talk about anything yeah, because the more yeah. I onge about it mm. the more ni kama na una fuel of fire na fuel of fire mm. you know get eh mm. na the worst thing inakuanga ukicha fuel fire mtu tunasema tu about broken telephone yeah huyu atasikia atambia best yake best yake amambe but even if you say dingine ni sorry nye sio hiyo na ukumbuke watu hiyo wana grow man yeah so the best thing you can do as a man eh me always say as a man protect your kids Yeah, and take yeah. it on the chin yeah. Yeah. Ah, so manaume mm, kufa mm, nao bwana yeah. yeah. so kwani una wa junior ngapi awili yeah. mm. how old eh 12 mm. na 1 na 5 oh 12 na 1 na 5 um so what any the same mother mm. yeah so e time nini um uh, e, nini li happen kwa sasa hii ni hiyo iko nini so lazima <laughs> cuz ile story tulikamkusikia mm. tulikamtukusikia tunaambwa like eh, daddy yao na miachwa na na dem mm. dem yake ameendea tycoon si ndio mm. but mimi nikikuangalia mm. even hata from what mse wote ametusikiza na you're not a poor man yeah. and you're not a struggling man si ndio yeah. alafu vile nimesema mse wake na mashini yako iko like hey! Yeye <laughs> he's living well. Sio. Mtikile yeye na likama aliona ndai yako ata kuongea alikato. Katulia. Kasema I have to work hard. <laughs> so yeah. si atuna una, una struggle. So hii story ya Tycoon was it real ama ilikuwa tu ni media il come up na. Eh kuna zingine ni noma sana kuongea because yeah, yeah. hii story ile inapaka kotini so sasa zaka kujua oh, usaviu okay. hapa sahibu yeah, 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 kitu yeah, yeah, yeah. na nzi wote unajua so eh na sema tu bade mi marriage yangu kuisha idisha hiyo siezi hiyo siezi hiyo siezi deny haikuisha mm. fiti mm. of course kuna Sorry of course zilitokea mm. some ziliko kweli some ziliko kweli but yeah, yeah. nimesema tu eh marriage yangu ilisha mm, mm. na it didn't take time of course kujua now what next yeah, yeah, eh, yeah. 
na iko isha poa mm. of course mimi yeah, yeah, yeah. na yeah. nini age age zenu was there a big gap between you wawili age wise mm. um, uh, uh, kubwa kubwa kiasi ka mm. three, four years Oh, three, four years. Mm. Skip That's kubwa, jo. Yeah. understandable. Yeah, mi yangu wage 11. Jo. Mm. Yeah. So, eh, so mwa gana shida, kuna tamu ufikiri ya ga, hama udemi nilimpata before I enjoy life. Kwa zuja, kuna kwa gana yo face, kuna watu, kuna tayi, mtu aneza taka, aneza skip a few steps in life, mm. atake kurudi back. Mm. Mm. Kwa zuja, mm. reason nafanya nasema hivo, mm-hmm. niliona ga uli stay na ring for long sana, sindio? Yeah, yeah. When you gonna stay in a ring was do, did you feel like you could still mend the relationship ama not really mm. i just felt like at that time ni gonna ni point i need to control my own narrative because mm. mm. kamali is like everyone is telling you what to do ah yeah, yeah. so if kamali ata answers zangu ni gonna pia say answers kulingana mm. vena if kamali na control my own narrative mm. whatever i'm telling guys see exactly what i want and yeah, what i yeah. mean umenelewa mm. ilikuwa tu ndio wase wase cuz if you're not careful ili fika mani kama na control you na mm. whatever is happening around yeah, me yeah, yeah. Mm. so sikutaka ku lose who i am and i think a man you must be deviant mm. in a way and by by, by di, being deviant you 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 kupata your ego mm. na kuonesha who you are as a man yeah. so eventually you realize i can still do this mm. i can still say no na bado ibaki no mm. so nilikana mm. now mostly just to be ilikuwa to more of being deviant yeah yeah oh, okay because sayo kinaweza kuwa nakwambia toy ring to buy your ring mm. yeah. so mm. me i'm just like it's not a big deal mm. <laughs> whether you have it or not it's not a big deal yeah. but it's not like the way people are saying oh ni kama hajaamini mm. ni kama nataka kurudi mm. ni kama i'm just like no mm. for me i just have it because ndato wasiki nataka kutoa ili kama mpaka nikaambia wase Mm. Yeah, so that at least you just remain who you are, true to who you are. Mm. Now you're not doing it because everyone is telling you remove it umetoa. No, no, no. Mm. I don't want to do that. Now how could get zile jokes za nini? Cuz kuna zile jokes we enjoy at wasi wa western. Kipata dem light skin wa gato na cheesy joke go. Hizo ni nipigwa nazo bro. Eh yeah, mazembe yeah. niambiwa kila kitu. Mm. Eh hey, bro mimi mm. nilipigwa kama 3 months. Niko na trend kila siku Twitter. Alafu ngo hivi eh hey, mm. natoka. Mm. Nilitrend kama 3 months man. Na zote unajiona unapigwa hapa, unapigwa kasha, unapigwa nini? But uh, mm. I, I think mimi kitu sana ni nilikuwa nisha before any, everything happens eh. Mm. Ni kama kulikuwa na anticipation of things. Eh yeah, eh. Yeah, yeah. Unajua tayari hapa liko. Na mm. ifiako kuna vitu unajua nga ya yeah, ina, inafika tunaanza kusambaratika bas yeah. so kuna wako ka anticipation so unajua maybe to the to the whole world kulikuwa nizo ni new to them but for mm-hmm. you wewe unajijua unajua mm-hmm. kwanza as a man instincts zako zinakuwa na very right mm-hmm. watu wengi sema mademu kwa na instinct kwa macha lakini mimi sema macha ile kwa na instinct it's only that si unyamazi ya vitu eh yeah, eh yeah. demata react on her instincts mm-hmm. ata react instincts zikamwambia eh hey, umsana cheat mm-hmm. ataanza ku investigate yeah. but chali unakuwa ngana zile za unajua a lot but just because you don't react to it mm. it doesn't mean that you don't have all those instincts uko nazo ni tu uko na zile za machedi si utakujua after this then what mm. demu utakujua eh hey, nimekupata mwafu mm. nitakudi na wewe sahi mbona umefanya hivi eh yeah. lakini sasa tena kwa zile za eh hey, oh amefanya hivi because of this mm. nikishamaliza hii phase was the next step uh, yeah uh, Okay. Yeah. Na sasa vile unasema um, ulikuwa una na signs. Uh hii divorce ilikuwa kwa happen ilikuwa which year? Was this 2020? Uh, 2020. 2020. Mm. So on time gani ulianza ku feel like eh hey, tuko headed to the end. Cause eh kuna zile vitu una feeling tu cause mimi noma ilikuwa nayo noma nilikuwa nayo sana ilikuwa kuna wakati mentally nilikuwa na feel bidu zangu aziko azi work vez na fuck work eh yeah, yeah. but sikuwa na cuz mimi si mimi si na believe at gym depression on is on nonsense kwa mimi mtu nimeelewa nime ushagone hizo naelewa mwanaume mluya kwanza unajua kuna mzee yeye umunduko mmoja umunduko mmoja bana yeah una face life eh yeah, bana mm. una mm. vijina kama wewe unaipeleka vijina kama bana yeah, yeah. 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 so ah, but inafika mali unaanza kuona eh hey, manzi kuna kitu ni kama kuna kitu ni uko kwa unajua kuna 
ini interface mm. lakini kule ndani kwa motherboard kuna kitu na happen yeah, kwa processor yeah, yeah. sasa ni kwa rafiki kama kuna vitu mom zina load kwa processor mm. na si understand nini but tunapata mostly more of nizo vitu umeshinda ukizi ukizichukua unazilo tu kwa nyuma na zilo tu kwa nyuma na zilo tu so i think one day zikuza zikararuka zika kwa zile za hey bro now something is not right something is not happening and i think covid ilikuwa the worst stage of my life mm. because at that time Hey, unajua sawa yeye pia ni msanii. Mm. And then mimi ni mtu hata tukianza interview nimekwambia mimi mm. shina na travel. Yeah, yeah. Bro mimi ni mtu napenda kupiga raundi. Mm. So COVID niliweka position sasa niko kapo. Mm. Hakuna mali unaenda. Mm. So see at that moment your mind inaanza ku ku, ku reason out vitu nyato je fikiria unaweza fikiria. Mm. Yeah. So hapo 2020 nilikuwa naweza kwamba ilikuwa the worst moment yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay okay feel hey hapana mm. yeah. hey, time kwa, na at any point we get uncomfortable mm. Mm. to stop mm. eh. mm-hmm. but e time unaishikwa keja na tosha naji na cause mko na watu wawili so watu wawili kwa kwa keja aona nini kwa bedroom stuff out ama kwa pamoja kwa bedroom eh yeah. uh, keja i think six bedroom oh, bedroom. Oh, okay six so na guess for it to reach a level ile time naambia na hii imetosha kuna time ilibidi muishi like different bedrooms some hapa sana wife si tu jiko na hizo moment si tu kwa yeah, kwa hizo yeah. moment mm. mm. tu kwa kwa hizo moment mm. mm. so li, like muli stay in the same bed till the last day okay unajua anya ngambe tu kweli eh i don't think kulikuwa na moment weird kama hizo but mimi naweza kuambia kitu moja kama sahi kwa maybe kwa marriage yako eh? yeah, one thing yeah, that we yeah. machali wengi wanakosanga kutackle ku, ku ni mm. whenever you have issues eh wasa wengi uzieka chini under wraps mm, mm. unaelewa mm. unaeka tu kwa kama mat chini ya ragu unaeka tu yeah. shida inakuanga ni one day itakutega mm. kuna jina pile up ina form ka aunt sasa <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, kama ni itakutega mm. sasa so, kitakutega ndo ta realize ni imentega Mm. ndo kujo funua one oh hizi ndo zimefanya nikateguka nikaanguka nikangoa meno you understand mm. but but time you're putting it there how realizing one day itakuja itafura itakuwa bump ah. eh. so hizo ndo hizo ndo vitumia sema most of the time marriages mobs na feeling hapo na pia naweza sema mimi ki look back yeah niambiwe sasa mse exactly what do you think is happening in marriages right now mm. i think madem wale nanga china ilikuwa when yeah, yeah. 19, the 19, beijing 19, conference yeah. ilikuwa 92 i think 92 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. i think 92 hapo yeah. mm-hmm. sio mm-hmm. beijing conference beijing conference unza unza tu search acha eh yeah. yeah. na kwa research guy ah yeah. ndio hiyo yeah. sasa yeah. so wakenda beijing eh? mm. wale of course the most important thing was equality yes should happen yeah Mm. but remember when in beijing at that time wazungu walikuwa shanza ku embrace hiyo equality mm. it's only africans who come embrace because when we time ilikuwa kina zipo ra kitoni ama zipo kina nani walikuwa nanga hizo wao represent maendeleo ya wanawake kenya yeah kuna mpaka mother flani ilikuwa politician wa ukambani eh. i think her name was the one that was associated with that i don't even know if she's still alive but i remember haiko nyiva mwendwa eh nyiva mwendwa yana sana eh those days yeah wewe nyiti rada tunaongeje report amba so those days eh when they came back of course walikuja na kitu cha kuwa custom make for custom made for of course the west the western world um. which musema is not wrong at all mm-hmm. but the biggest mistake that really happened is eh mm. when the women were empowered mm. no one told the boy child yeah how you should handle an empowered the, woman an empowered woman mm. because mm. most of us your first hero in your life and the the hero that unaweza shinanga uki ukiona every your superman mm. your dad yeah kwanza most of, most of us boys mm. your dad no ule hero kwanza shaiona na u hero unaangalia anga ali, ali ali survive kwa hii life mm-hmm. unaanza kwa apply hizo vitu alitumia ku survive akakuwa hero mm. the second person unaangalia ni your, your mother so the moment unataka ku replicate exactly what you, you you saw growing up is you take the elements from your dad mm. and then you look for a woman mm. mwenye anakam close to your ma 
yeah your mother yeah so the worst thing in akwanga you want to pretend the same things mm. that your father did mm. utazifanya mm. and the same thing now we now unakuja una expect the same thing that your mother did for your father your wife should do them mm. Mm. but sasa unapata udem amesoma udem ni career woman udem anaishi kwa environment ya something called hypergamy yeah and hypergamy is real bro mm. what's hypergamy what's an ulisa bro so good so this is like your, your conference will like, uh, in september 1995 mm. oh, 95 yeah, yeah. Uh, september 4th to september 15 so yeah okay yeah. okay so hypergamy ni mm. most of the time machali uzuzi wanasema eh ukisha kwa na dem ukisha mchonga chonga kidogo ama pata job atakusare ndio msemo mwingine yeah yeah So the analogy is eh, mm. women will always marry higher. Higher. Yes, yes. In the sun. Yeah. A man can marry most of the time because most African men mm. ama wale mostly threatened men wana marry lower yeah, because they yeah. always feel like hey, I, you just need to be, for you to be submissive you must mm, be mm, mm, lower. Mm, mm. So hypergamy happens mm. because most of the time eh, if you talk to women most kama sai sai na I mingle with very high level women in my yeah. life. Most of yeah. my friends in very yeah. high level women in my life. Mm. No kenge now vizuri wanakuambia hypergamy in happening most of the time because most women on a feeling the moment wakisha mkisha wana ukisha muoa mm. wao unafanga every now and then uko 10 steps ahead. Yeah, yeah. The moment they catch up with you mm. the fascination dies. Mm. Mm. You understand? Mm. And this is my analogy. Mm. Me I always believe women women are attracted to power yeah, are yeah. fascinated with the power not money mm, mm. it's only that money inakujanga through the element mm. ama ni one of those elements ya power yeah but women are fascinated with that's why unapatanga mko tu mtaani makanga sieti anachapa man lakini anapita na mademu wenyu wote man kwa nini because you maganga kinge kwa stage pale kila mtu anamuita yeye ni aje ni aje so madem anakuwa fascinated ama mseti unapata mseti ameingia club na dem umsa kinge hiyo club kila mtu anamsalimia dem ako fascinated umse ni nani you understand so they always fascinated about power and you know you know about physical because hata ukienda biblically when the devil alikuja kutempt eve alijoizing na adam because adam already alikuwa anajua place yake yeah adam knew all these promises are real adam knew all these things if i want access i can get them but a woman at that time eve alikuwa anashindwaje mbona mimi siezi mbona siezi question what is happening mm-hmm. so the first thing they were mdanganya nao ni ndakupea nini power mtakuwa powerful mtaandasan everything so it's it's biblical women are fascinated with the power mm-hmm. so in any marriage most of the guys say you get to resolve in your hypergamy you happen because utapata mm-hmm. women move up the rank even even hata ukiangalia mostly peer vitu kama kwa job eh? unapata dem leo ni leo dem anafanya tu job ya kawaida kama secretary eh, eh. kesha amekuwa manager mm. Two years from now amekuwa brand manager yeah. Three years from now amekuwa director mm. Four years from now amekuwa ceo mm. you mm. understand mm. so If you look at that progress right now cuz I know your aspect ya eh gender balance gender balance so mm-hmm. eventually unapata most men sabaki unaelewa yeah, yeah. and then most men right now wengi wanapenda kuwa entrepreneurs na vitu kama most men wanapenda hiyo kuwa entrepreneur mm-hmm. na entrepreneurship si rahisi by the way mm-hmm. moving up the rank of any mimi nimefanya biz yeah. before biz yako ianza ku make hizo turnovers eh, ni hard sana it could take a longer time rewards ni crazy of course but before we go the rewards crazy e kama 10 years ama 5 years hapa katikati mm. ni very few people who can live with you to understand that one day one time mm. itakuja pay off yeah yeah because madem wengi wezi shina hope mm. 
nikaa mtoi wako mtoi wako akitaka maziwa nataka maziwa mtoi wako huwezi mwambia na hope kesho nitanunua maziwa ah ah akitaka maziwa kwenda chuko kesho lamo uko na hiyo maziwa so unfortunately tuko na hiyo level ya wase wengi wezi kuna ukipata partner aizi shina hiyo hope kwanza kama wewe ni mse unapenda hizo high reward unajua cuz mimi nisafanya biz manze in making ni yake ya kwanza after kama 6 years bro yeah yeah you get so mtu ku believe that the first six years ni kulima mm-hmm. na wewe una believe if vision yangu one day it pay off mm-hmm. so mtu ku believe hiyo vision one day it pay off ni very few because juzi nilikuwa na eh hey, karibu ni mention ningechoma mm-hmm. nilikuwa na mtu na discuss na hey, juzi mm-hmm. akaniambia kuna kitu inaitwa is it intelligence emotion ama kitu hiyo emotional intelligence emotional intelligence yes emotional intelligence yeah, yeah. ile yenye dema anatoka job mm, mm. anataka mdiscuss vitu kama zile wanakwenda discuss na CEO wake yeah. na wewe wewe umeshinda mtaani kwa keja the whole day mm, mm. umetaongea nini yeah. umenelewa mm. so macheli wengi unapata wewe umeshinda job ya kiwanja yeah. dem na ameshinda kwa ofisi mm, mm. mkimit jioni intelligence yenyewe iko on the same level mm, mm. kwa zenda kuambia venye Leo manzee in the morning ni limit manager akanambia nina nina nini nikatoka hapo nikaambia meet HR mm. akanambia hivi na hivi nikatoka pale nika meet my boss mm. akanambia din meet my KPIs and hizo vitu zote yeah, yeah. so you want uki mention vitu kama hizo you are guy and understand yeah, yeah. lakini ukipata understand you always feel like this this is too high for me to discuss with him mm, mm. I'd rather look for someone else mm. when you discuss na eh mwenza kwa the same level of intelligence mm. eh hey, juga vile hata umebanga jua KPI ni kula i have had this before mm. Mm. but <laughs> unachukia lana itumia casually tu yeah, yeah. <laughs> KPI ni Mata tu kwa performance indicators eh? oh keep performance <laughs> okay okay KPI to list kia for that dinner yeah like mwaka ile time kulikuwa na that housing debate yeah yeah and then there was something oh, we were supposed okay. to do and mm. pitch something mm. Oh, and then get the key performance indicators. <laughs> <Yes>. Okay. Tutaendelea. <laughs> so, unaona hizo hizo ni discussions zenye ukipata mse amwezi discuss net with that level, yeah. una feeling hii bala ku discuss na yeye, mm. hata nikaanza kuambia shida zangu, mm. sija meet my KPIs. Mm. Before ni break it down what is KPI and the explain it take long. Na mimi niko na emotionals. Niko emotional right now. Yeah. Nataka tu ku air out what I face today at the office. Yeah, yeah. So most of the time at after time semu nyana za kuwa na e at that level. Yeah. Wanna discuss that level. Mm. But ukumbuke is transition ni happened for like 7 8 years, 10 ah, years. Ah, ah. Before at the moment afika hapo intelligence yake fikia that level. Mm. Chaidi ndo pata meo wewe ka uli, uli drag behind ukabaki tu kwa ile kitu yako unafanyanga. Mm amtakuwa na emotional intelligence okay okay so you can affect ma- marriage mingi sa ipi mm, mm. so mm. in very many words yeah. unatuambia you married a career woman but me ni married a career woman yeah so yeah. you feel like career woman ye ku go up the career ladder mm. kuna like some key it create some cracks kwa relationship yenu because uh, it happens it happens because vile tume tumetoka kusema we've established how could I struggle financially si ndio mm. but of course if you marry a career woman atako umefika a certain level of wealth there's always going to be other more they need men like ama CEOs and what there's going to be all those kuna wase wako maybe a level higher than you so you maybe uh your music career umefika hapa and you've stayed there for long ulikuwa unabonga jua plateau mm. Do you feel like that was it going to happen way career me plateau yeah bado anaendelea in the career Cuz you maybe at that time ushafika pinnacle of your career Yeah 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 Wo oh, wo oh, ushafika point unajua uko self actualization mm, mm. I want anything higher than that because I think I'm a single artist with the most mo, your record ikifanywa research I think ndakuwa number 1 ama number 2 A single artist with the most awards in Kenya yes, I yeah. think I'm one, mm, one of those mm, artists Cuz I think you mentioned mamas casually yeah, yeah, like mamas Yeah <laughs> Yeah bro mm, mm. I think niki count awards zangu zinaweza kata 30 yeah, mm. yeah. individual awards yeah. So you see and that time sikuwa nimefikata 35 years mm. Hizo na kuambia nikishikeza ma 1.2 I don't think I can finish 35 years. Yeah, yeah. You get. So 
at a young mind you feel like kusha hit your pinnacle mm, mm. so you just need an, a new challenge if you alexander the greater kwanza yeah. hakuna place nyingine za kukonka you just need a new challenge but new in new challenge you must challenge yourself mm. ufike the new challenge menelewa mm. but at the same time easy to zote pia but na ko pia na fuck understand yeah yeah which if you're not careful mm. in your marriage if you are not at that same level of understanding mm. in a kwa tashish kidogo yeah, yeah. Mm. Oh, okay okay mm. okay na nini since pia alikuwa kariya woman cuz vile tumesema unajua we are both learning mm-hmm. in this world eh? mm-hmm. so since alikuwa a career woman mlikuwa like who used to do duties kama cooking was it her was it mlikuwa na mboch mlikuwa vitu kama hizo mko medwaje cuz you both had money Yeah, of course. Mm. Uh, uh, Sasa sa kugusa sana sana. <laughs> Nikigusa sana. Itaenda <laughs> sana. Na unajua, mimi nimesema tu, unajua kuna watu wengine sisi 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 chombo ya mother watu wangu jo. Eh at the end of the day, atabaki kwa mother watu wangu. Yeah, yeah. Okay, because others gonna na bonga je specifically but I understand. I understand kwa nini. Eh, unajua utaisema i Eh yeah, wasi wataipati a whole other bus a whole other life. Yeah, itakuwa monster flani yenyewe utaikuipa yeah, yeah. But mm. awoni kama ukiavoid ku, kuisema ndio sasa kwa like of course. <laughs> <laughs> Unajua uzuri kama mm. ujaisema mm. au na back in a speculation. Unajua yeah. nimekwambia sometimes mm. kuna vingine vingine ukishasema umeconfirm because you know this is what is going to occur. There's nowhere. Musema kwa hizo stories zote zijai tokea on, yeah, on yeah, social media. Hakuna yeah. siku moja mtu alikuote Daddy Owen said. Yeah. Most of the time nilikuwa nasikia zimeandikwa Daddy Owen said. Mm. Zilikuwa clickbait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ukienda pale ukiklick unapata ni interview ya kawaida hakuna mali Daddy Owen alisema kitu kama hiyo. Mm. But imeandikwa mm. hapo mm. Daddy Owen says the wife did what what and what. Mm. Lakini ukiklick ukiona hiyo interview unaona paka mwisho unashindwa ah. Yeah, hakuna But hakuna mali amesema. Mm. Umenishika. Mm. So mimi hakuna one day nina nikaongea Yes, my bye. ex ama mm. nikaanza kusema kitu mbaya about my ex no mm. no day cuz nilikuwa najiambia nga ya watu hii at the end of the day mm. si fair mm. ah, kitu ingine hata kama ni kitu ili happen ya yeah? mm. i'm done with the decision kumari huo mtu yeah yeah umenelewa mm. so kama mwanaume shida mm. zako kufa nazo bro mm. Mm. shida zako si lazima utangaze dunia mzima zina shida wewe mwenyewe ulijiingiza ndani kama ni shida yako Budama alikuwa anambia nga eh buda shida yako kana shida yako shida yako ngana nao paka udai naye. Hmm. Yeah. Na hii ruma ya nini unafikiri ilitokea wapi? Cuz haikutoka kwa ina circle yako ama ina circle yake. Hii ruma ya taiku. Pia pia, pia, pia ina circle yangu kuna ina circle yangu kuna mali wali 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 let down wali nimesa. Yeah, yeah, eh yeah, yeah. eh mm. walitoa ina circle yangu walitoa sorry mob zenye zilikuwa unashindwa sasa mwana unatoa sorry kai. Mm, eh mm, mm. Uh, sorry mob ina soko kuna zingine unajua zilikuwa zile zenye you being a famous guy yeah yeah, yeah. and then msea ona kitu flani me happen ana connect ana shindo oh no ana ilikuwa na happen hivi because iko because huyu ni msef namjua so kama ni hivi basi hivi sije kwa nishika mm. because if the moment you are a famous guy mm. it's so easy for someone to connect the dots mm through your kids yeah. ama through your partner yeah so adam toyaka kufanya mistake mm. wata connect the dots ajue oh mm. ama partner yake kufanya mistake because wewe ni mtu unajulikana already mm. you understand so we mean like already a household name mm. ilikuwa so easy wase ku pick out kujua oh umsa yuko na wife yake yeah, kuna cracks um, eh umenishika eh, mm. eh mm. ilikuwa so easy mm. so unfortunately in a, wana semanga it comes eh, with the ter- with the territory mm, mm. mm. cuz i think ilikuwa cast ko wrong there was an infamous i think photo I think ilikuwa in another place na hauko hapo ikakuwa eh hey, si unaona i think <laughs> na kwa kitu kama hiyo mwaga na memory mbaya eh eh ndio hizo hizo zote ina circle love nje pia within your inner circle kuna watu wenye wanawatakia na watu wanawataki na kuna watu wenye hauko na bambika na whatever you guys were doing hauko na bambika whatever was happening mm. so kuna wanyana kutakia mazuri na kunyawa kutakia mazuri. Yes, so yes. so zingine zikoze zinatokea najiambia hii hii ziko mtu mwingine ametoa hii story. Mm, ili lazima mm. tu ni mtu wa watu wa karibu. Eh. Yeah. Kuna story nilikuwa naziona najua. Eh hey, hii ni hii ni handi. Mm. Ili lazima hii ball ilicheza pale kwa box. Hii hizi kwa enjoy it na hivi kwepena. Hii imeshikia bwana ni ya box hapa. Yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. So refa kipointa semeni pena. Mm. Wezi argue. Hii tuko kwa box. Mm. Eh. 
na hii time kulianza kuwa na cracks like who are you talking to now as a man cuz pia men tunajuka daga one thing anze bro yendo ilikuwa na mayango na mayango ilikuwa mimi sikuwa na bonga na mse na mayango sikuwa na bonga na mse but unajua pia una understand unajua ukishakuwa unajua kuna vitu vingine pia si ujekele zenye as make sense yeah sometimes it makes sense sometimes it makes sense cuz unajuliza me one of the biggest regret pia niko nao kwa ongezea kwa ile nyingine nilisema ni kuma in so much what will people say yeah yeah, yeah nilishinika yeah. kitu for 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 so many years eh? mm. i think after 2020 is when i realize ah, i don't care what people say because after 2020 you miss kuna scandal yote yeah, yeah, yeah. so when 2020 so things will tokea ni ka realize whether ni keep out of any scandal ama ni part of any scandal mm. kuna scandal nyingine itakupata yenye si ume create yeah. imekupata na bado people will say what they want to say mm. So after that nilikuwa nyenye nilikuwa nayo wari kila siku kuwari eh eh nikifanya hivi wasa utasema nikifanya hivi wasa utasema nikuja nikwambie eh bro napitia mambo manze wasa utasema nilikuwa najiuliza maswali sana but right now after year 2020 nika realize whether i do anything i don't do anything people still talk so before that bro nilikuwa na nyama zetu yeah, yeah. siku na bonga na mse siku na mbia mse chanapitia hata familia yangu na waficha na ficha mabeshti na ficha hata wala tuna look up tu ama tunaongana nao unajua mm, mm. yeah so, so ka- kama regeli katika 2020 na unasema ulikuwa umenyamazia kwani ilikuwa according to well ilikuwa ilikuwa ime end when no like before there, ha- there has to be a point maybe ile ulifika then nimekwambia noma hiyo kwa kazi vitu under the mat mm. isn't it zenye before the fika about and the mat ungosha mm. bonga na wasa ingi kwa ingi kwa under the mat yeah yeah unaelewa i go under the mat mm even to nyenye sai na na look back na julizaje mbona hizi zote ziko na semanga mm. yeah so you know mm. take machari pia suji ko sometimes na hizo vitu mm. cuz kuna mabozi wako ndio mi kuna mi kuna sana na jonga ni critic wangu mbaya na zampia ngoma yangu nisikitie utasema nini yeah. sasa nataka advice yake ndaka sikia arani kisa to what level yeah umenishika so sometimes hiyo kuongea na wase inasaidia anga sana kuna wase si lazima kupata the best advice mm-hmm. ama si lazima kuombe kitu important but i think the joy comes from you airing out mm-hmm. you understand the satisfaction comes from you kuisema tu you get mm-hmm. yeah so umesema a very good point mm-hmm. machalisi huko na hiyo eh kuna hiyo elements you play a very big role tutakatunyamazi eh ya kunyamazia vitu mm. until zifike level yenyewe nao mm. is a point of no return yeah. mm. oh, okay na nini um nita ni kwanta kukuuliza saa eh, ikikam to parenting saa mmefanyaje cuz as you said it's a modern woman mm. and the modern woman wants some level of control ccp has also modern fathers we want to be really tight with our kids so your balance on a strike ile like ya we na watu wako of course eh, ni kitu new mm. eh, parenting iko ngi rahisi vinyo na fikiria eti itakuwa tu rahisi yeah, in the first, yeah. first days because ni kitu new for both of you mm. si kitu ati ushaiona cuz mimi nimeelewa na eh, both eh, mother father eh, mm. uh, uh, tight needs family and all that mm. so ni new so each and every day you will make mistakes mm. eh, you try to change things here and there mm then you realize pole pole you'll get the hang of it mm. yes. so we wa junior wako na wewe maye wako na oh okay mm. okay so una try to go like how frequently at least still ah, uh, atuna yo ti lazima ikwe mm, mm. uh, time flani mm. ah, yo eh, but at least digitally mna zona na eh oh, excuse the options ni mob hiyo ndio kitu inasaidia aje kitambo ilikuwa kaka ujaona mtu hujamuona eh excuse the options ni mob ah ah kwa sababu nilisikia kuna mtu alisema at difference ya back in the days na relationship ya back in the days na size ni when the husband left the house the woman could actually miss him ajo mm. kwa sababu kwa mnaongea mpaka jioni eh by the mm. basi kuzi tunazoeana juu every 2 minutes kwa eh unadu oh, okay eh, 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 at the top eh, of the hour eh, eh, yeah. Yeah. top so, of the hour mm, mm. Ile, <laughs> absence makes the heart grow fonder yeah yeah, yeah. kuzi hakuna yol Three absence you know uh, by the man like full time you looking give you unapewa maji moto na hoga nini sikiza kuna pamoja tu oh sikiza ushajua ametoka saa ngapi ameko wapi saa ngapi mm-hmm. na lunch amekula nini lunch hakuna yeah. kitu anaweza kuambia jioni yeah. 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 sasa yetu unaweza kuwa na time ya kulana about kpis yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Kwa sasa kwambia Atlantic time. Oh, okay, okay. Sasa unataka kurudi kwa uanza wa marriage tena ama umefungia chapter? Eh manzee unijue swali ni mwanzo na watu wengi wanasema oh ulipata kienyeji sijui nini unijue hizo vitu zote unijue ilifika mahali hata hiyo time nilikuwa nasema vitu tu ndio yani yeah, yeah, yeah. uh, I, I don't know if easy to discuss na mse mm. I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing yeah. but I normally find myself bado na unajipata na au high class yeah mi kama say wale mabesi zangu wa close my dame yeah. bado ni hao to high end women mm, 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 mm. i don't think ni kona and, and i don't think it's a bad thing yeah, because yeah. you work so hard as a man mm. to become a high value man yeah. now of course usa kwa high value man mm. watu kwa around wewe of course mm. ni hao high end yeah, women yeah. cuz kajuzi ni kwa nakachina ngala sako yangu ya madem wote kwa around mimi mm. i don't think kuna dem mwenye si high end si yeah, high class yeah, and all mm, that mm. but Is it something that you feel like you want to go back to it because mimi another kongeza kwa regret another yeah. regret na konga nayo ni i wish ningeza in my 20s yeah. mosa mayo i wish mm. in my 20s mm. ningeita watu watu wengi in my 20s oh okay uh, mm. mimi wish ningona kama watano hivi in my 20s mm. yeah mm. kwa nini nili grow up in a big family mm. na mimi kama kuna I think kuna narrative ya kudanganya wase how watu hiyo wanafawaishi saa hii yeah. tujitie pressure to a level whereby oh watu hiyo wanafaa kwenda si private school gani watu hiyo wanafaa kufanya nini mm-hmm. and then so kisha kuna hizo pressure unaona eh hey, si za watu wengi because mm-hmm. but he, if uki adopt watu hiyo are exposed to what they yeah. know is mm-hmm. right yeah, yeah. at that moment yeah mm-hmm. now we enjoy to growing up in a very good family in a big family Hata hiyo anaizo ti lazima ende shule flani. Na drama I think si wenyeka parents wenyu. Eh sujiwekea. Kuna kwa gana ile tuna as parents tuna compete. Tunasahau. So I don't think in my 20s ninge ninge shindwa ku afford. Napeleka chuo poa. And then reason ni pia the most important thing ni at least you see in your 20s. But time you in your 40s watu wako shafika in their 20s. Yeah, ni adults. Ushashika eh? Yeah. But so ni sasa hii tuko in our 40s. So tuna ndo tunaza kukimizana but time tutafika maybe yeah. in our 80s ndo atakuwa yeah. in our 40s so yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you gap eh you gap ni so sana eh you gap ni so sana yeah so okay. you you know defense tunaweza sema mm. so ulikomoza nini kwanza um like una plan kurudi kwa uanzo oh hii mm. uanzo ni ni very unpredictable yeah. <laughs> ni very unpredictable mm. uh, of course na natamani ku add watu wengine ba you see yeah natamani kusa lazima nikuulize hizo jana kurudisha huko but saa kwa nini ulikuwa na hii gap ya 7 years between watu wawili ilikuwa jua career ya dem ama ilikuwa jua vitu, uh, vitu zilikuwa mob hapo katikati mm. eh mambo za wedo vitu zilikuwa mob mm. mm. so sasa yada zaina nafikiria bado ni nataka nafikiria get watu wengi nafikiria mm. bado nafikiria okay. but unajua sasa watu hizi si, si mtoto anakuja na mama yake Yeah. Oh, 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 unataka tu wa ni kwa example uende ni kuna place inaitwa huisero nataka niko na huisero unajua sasa ni mambo na watu eh watu kama eh we kuzira comments mingi nilikuwa napigwa nazo naambia waenda tu utafuta mluya huko kwenye woe ama tafuta kienyeji ama but you see it's not as you wake up in the morning and just deciding yeah because musema at the end of the day lazima ukwe na vile nimesema tu sorry ya emotional intelligence lazima yeah, yeah. pia kwa ni mtu mnaweza kana eh na muonge mjo to that level mm, unajua mm, mm. na mimi nikiangalia vizuri watu wenyewe mushi na na hang out now mm. fortunately yeah ama unfortunately ni hao ni hao mm. you get mm. and it's just through the same circle that is easier for you to get someone mnaweza understand each other to that level uh, um. yeah yeah na wenye walona hang out round wako married wako single wako in the same age group are they still ah, single wa young kiasi unajua mm, mm. kuna hizo yani zile zinapiga unaangalia hivi unaona eh mm. eh 
yani ukisema one day if i decide mm. eh, unaangalia circle yako njoo mwana wewe paka uji analyze pia yeah yeah unaangalia unasema hii ni realistic is it realistic yeah mm. mm. so ukiangalia circle yako ni hiyo tu bado yeah yeah, yeah unafaa tu kucheza level yako cuz mm. vile tu ulisema 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 hypergamy yeah, yeah hypergamy yeah uh, na afu kitu kuna kitu umesema powerful sana mm. ile hii anajua anajua juu yangu mm. but all gonna go through it in a different way mimi mm. nimetiki vile tu umesema nimetiki wife aki start from chini kabisa mm. to from intern sasa hizi kwa management mm-hmm. so i know what you're talking about mpaka <laughs> niko zile za eh mm. i hope yango itatana kwanza <laughs> 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 kuwa manager yes i as a good manager so ni, ni interesting sana yeah. but sije angalia from hiyo cuz nikiangalia wife who's a woman mm. na angalia mabeste zangu wengi mm. most of my male friends mm hata wale wako career mm. hawajaenda that fast. Mpaka yeah. hata kuna time mwa bega like eh yeah. fun enough like that's a debate we're going to like discuss. You know debate we're going to talk about discuss. But madam we should very fast. Yeah yeah yeah. Mm. Auenda. Mm. Auenda. Mm. Auenda. Yeah, yeah. Mm. So ni imekuwa interesting. Kwa sababu na kukaanza ka intern. Eh? Yeah. Yeah, so bro unaweza uh, kuambia sasa hii. Mm. Wewe sasa kitu unafaa <laughs> <laughs> ni emotional intelligence eh hey, hii hii hi, songeze hiyo cause you know siku na ngaje cause ni kama kweli eh that is advice they go yeah. the higher they go <laughs> the cool it will come for you <laughs> <laughs>